Susan Mangeni has urged Kenyans to gain access to insurance products to better protect their livelihoods, invest in their futures, and contribute to the stability of their communities. That's a photo moment right there. There you go. <laughs> Some companies like premium, they don't insure. Okay, Madam uh, Beatrice, what was your first encounter with, with... You can be clapping even as this happens. At the heart of our ministry's mandate lies the vital mission of formulating comprehensive investment and private sector development policies focus on those that are underserved and unserved by the traditional financial services industry. We are driven by the goal of creating an environment that nurtures entrepreneurial endeavors, propels economic growth, and empowers every level of Kenyan society. We, we've always been doing the innovative, time-consuming time work of really building the affordable insurance market in Kenya. However, this license now enables us to do even more and to properly um, design the products that we want without relying upon the other underwriters in, in the market to be able to, to do what we know the customers want us to do. So we're deeply grateful to the government of Kenya for fostering an enabling environment for microinsurance. Uh, and we look forward to continue to collaborate with the IRA as a key partner in this journey. Basically why we wanted to get this microinsurance is that we wanted people who will increase availability of those services to as many people as possible, distribute it cheaply and with a quick turnaround. And uh, if you were to look at the law, we provided that once somebody has launched a claim, you must pay within 10 days. Now the